Okay. Um, that was weird. Huh. What is that? Do you guys see that? Because uh, uh, I use a hotkey, or I, I use a combination hotkey to uh, start my recordings, and it's Control Alt Shift Home. And when I pressed Home, a little bullet appears on the screen. That's weird. But anyways, we're playing some receiver, and um, huh, it's a uh, low poly bullet. Look at that. You see that? Every time I press Home. All right. Well, anyways, we're gonna play some receiver. This time, I'm gonna try to get five tapes, just like last time. But I will make sure that all of my bullets are out of my gun before I listen to it. Or at least, uh, yeah, when that when that stuff happens, when the guy takes like control of your mind, you press E then V. All right. What you need to do. That's what I need to do, sorry. But if you're playing this game, that's what you need to do as well. Because that will save your life. <laughs> five tapes, five tapes. I need five tapes. Where are these tapes at? Man, I gotta, f I gotta search for five tapes. It wouldn't be so bad, but it, this is a pretty stressful game, so, you know. You just gotta... Got these bullets. These early levels. I think this is an uh, yeah. This is an early level, so it's just turrets only. But I really hesitate what to think. Like, what happen if you uh, if you had to face off against some of the uh, later enemies? Oh. Gotta turn this way. Yes, you are. Okay. Turn around. Yeah, I don't think it's really recommended to shoot the uh, the uh, turrets. But since this is like the beginner level... <laughs> yeah, no, that's okay. When you get to the later levels though, probably have to save your bullets. Even more. Ooh, it's so dark in here. Wow. But I gotta go look for uh, tapes, so let's look for tapes. Game of tapes, come on. Where are them tapes at? No tapes in here? Okay, good. <laughs> I gotta make sure to clear those corners. Ooh, flashlight. Need it right now. Oh, man. EV. EV. Every time you pick up a tape, EV. Remove those bullets. Oh, goodness. Ugh. Come on, turn around. Come on. No, no, no. Turn around. There you go. Good job. There's another turret over there. Okay. All right. All right. I got this. I got this. I didn't get it. That was a good gun, too. One of the barrels was in block, so, you know, they were all clear. This one... Okay, this one's, uh... This one's clear, too. It looks like all the rounds haven't been fired, so I don't need to pull anything out. Okay, tapes. I need to find tapes. Come on. There's one thing I do wonder, though. Because there was a, um... Because the old receiver had cheats, right? And I'm not saying you gotta cheat to, to, to play the game, but I just, I'm just, uh, I'm just curious whether those cheats still work. 
So uh, let's try uh, IDKFA. IDKFA. <gasps> oh, hey, they do. <laughs> that gives you a lot of bullets. I. <sighs> IDDQD, right? Was the god mode? I think so. Hold on just a second. It's probably going to look weird on your end, but I'm in the uh, Steam overlay. I'm pretty sure I was IDDQD. I'm not going to put it in, but I'm just going to search on the uh, web browser here. Because that was the code for god mode, right? In Doom? Hold on. IDDQD. Yeah, it's God mode. Okay, uh, okay. Since IDKFA worked, I'm assuming ID uh, DQD works as well. So uh, I'm not gonna cheat. I'm gonna do this legit. It gave me a lot of bullets though, so I'm sorry about that. But <laughs> well, bullets aren't like my main concern because I need to find these these damn tapes, and uh, it's hard enough. <laughs> Even with a lot of bullets, it's pretty hard. But, uh, yeah, you know, sorry about that. I just, I just, I was just curious, uh, cause I remember those cheats from Doom. I remember those cheats in Receiver. So, so if IDKFA worked, then IDDQD works, so. Uh, what was the other one? Uh, SPIP, uh, SPI, Smashing Pumpkins, uh, something. I, I can't remember what it was, cause I never really use it that much. But, uh, there were, there were cheats in, uh, old receiver. First one. Receiver one. Oh, I don't need those. <laughs> Oops. Well, now I do. Okay, uh, I need uh, tapes. I need tapes. I need to find some tapes. You know, I mean, I always look up here at the uh, water tower, but there's usually nothing here. I don't know why. Oh, hey, there is a floppy disk over there. We're going to have to figure out how to get up there, though. Let's see if I can jump on this thing. And then, no, I can't do that. I'm just going to break my legs, which is terrible. Oh, wait, I can walk on the uh, wires. Oh, nice. Come on. No, no, get up on the... Oh, no! Oh, that's got to hurt. That's got to hurt. <laughs> Maybe he sprained an ankle. I uh, probably broke his leg, but <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're gonna try that again. Hold on. I want that floppy disk. Okay, I need to jump up and move forward. No, 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 no. It's like the game automatically pushes you, right? Which is kind of weird. But um all right, well. All right, uh, whatever. You know what? Let's just forget about that. I, I got to find these tapes. Eight minutes in, and I still haven't made any progress. <laughs> that's, that's, how, that's how crazy this game is. Let me check my weapon here. I got two rounds, one blocked. Well, that's five. Don't need to reload. I uh, don't need to eject any ma uh, uh, rounds. I'm good there. How many bullets do I have? Four. Well, uh, I don't really need them right now. But, uh... Nest door is not... Oh, here we, here we go. No tur no turrets, no turrets, no turrets, good. Okay, nice. 
It's common knowledge that some needs are a higher priority than others. People note that in order to pursue some, others must be fulfilled first. They frame the complex situation using a, a simple, unrealistic example. It's like how you can't be happy if you don't have air to breathe. <laughs> well, these simplifications are used to hide more complex truths. That the body sustains the mind, and the mind sustains the body. The most present needs are in the domain of the mind. Without baseline function of thought, you can find yourself without the will to move or eat. Strengthening the mind by developing focus and resilience is the goal of a technique we call mind tech. Ooh. <laughs> Let's not do that. Let's stop doing that, please. Stop doing that. Okay, since uh, I'm not uh, listening to any tapes right now, I'll put the bullets back in. Let's uh, spin this chamber there. Okay, that's good. Okay, give me tapes. Come on. Where are them tapes at? I need them tapes. Oh, that's a flashlight. That's good. I need that. Oh, bullets. I need bullets. No ladders? Oh, there's no ladder. Okay, well. Just keep going, I guess. Oh, we got a turret over there. Let me take care of that first before we, uh... Ooh. Nope. Okay. Good. Just pointed over there. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, now. It's dangerous to shoot certain things at close range. Oh. They actually simulate that? That's pretty cool. Oh, goodness. <laughs> it's a risky maneuver. Going past the door like that. Alright, uh, let me grab something. Nope, nothing. Nothing here. Oh, goodness! I don't even know where it is. Where is it? Oh, it's over there. I see it. Oh, man. Terrible. I don't think I got it. No, I didn't get it. I could shoot from here. Can I shoot underneath? I wonder if I can. I can. Nice. Let's pick up those bullets. That's what I like about the turrets now. You can, They drop bullets. So you can pick them up. Obviously, there's nowhere to go up there, right? I don't think so. Yeah, unless I want to break my legs. <laughs> right, let's go down for a bit. Also, you can shoot the balloons and gain ammo. You don't have to run into them, which is pretty nice. You know what? I'm gonna check here first. I know. Gotcha. Oh, there's another one. Oh, no, 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 no. Give me your bullets. I need your bullets. Thank you. Oh, man, I'm out.
Got it. Oh, goodness. Tape. Give me that tape. Many people believe that the brain is the seat of consciousness, yet important thoughts and feelings are carried out in ganglia, clusters of neurons found throughout the body. The mind stretches within the body and controls it. Conditions in the body reflect the mind, and damage to the body is damage to the mind as well. When confronting the, the threat, a receiver must always remain calm. Most people panic under pressure and, and, and shoot before properly aiming. Remember that it's better to fire one shot that hits than 10 shots that miss. Come on, give me that floppy disk. All right. Hmm. Yeah, you know, they say to ignore these things, but I can't because sometimes uh, you're not paying attention and then you get shot in the back, which is not a good thing. So I recommend destroying them. I mean, if you have to run, you can run, but, in, you know, what's going to end up happening is you're just going to get shot in the back, which is going to be terrible. Come on, give me some tapes. I need two more. No tapes here. Okay. No tapes there. Oh, there's a tape right there. All right, before I listen to it, E V U. Experiences are feelings connected to events. If an event that creates negative feelings happens often enough or is especially intense, it can create a phobic reaction. Even after distancing oneself from these events, these phobic elements can persist. Thoughts flow from one to the next, like water flowing down a river. And like water flowing, these thoughts can carve through stone given enough time. Trauma is like a boulder in the river, and over time, a correct sequence of thoughts can cut and shape it, eventually allowing the thoughts to pass safely and smoothly around them. All right. One more tape. That's all I need. One more tape. Mm. Oh, there it is. Oh, goody. Let's unload this stuff and just make sure. And holster the gun. Control your breathing as you approach the door, slowly slicing the pie as you go. You are in the fatal funnel now as you move in a semicircle past the door, but don't rush. See everything. Focus beyond that front sight. Let your body aim for you. Breathe. Corner's clear. It's time to choose a direction and commit. Left or right. Which way lies victory? Which way death? Only one way to find out. Breathe. Don't dawdle in the doorway. You're a silhouette and that's where the guns are aimed. And sweep the room smoothly to encompass the whole space. It's a difficult thing, but practice makes perfect. Slow is smooth. Smooth is fast. Nice. All right. I finally did it. Got the sleeper rink. Aha. We got a new weapon. But first, uh, what is this note? Since I woke up, recently disengaged. Don't know how long I've been here. Uh huh. Turrets. Threat echoes. Oh, here we go.
Hmm. Threat recovery tape. Glass. Okay. Shoot through panes of glass, yep. Ah, alright. That simulates that. That's pretty nice. It'll uh, destabilize the bullets. Okay. Interfere with the trajectory. Ah, it's possible to run and jump through glass, which I've already proven. Hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. The 1911, finally. 45 ACP, 7 plus 1. You can read that if you want, but uh, you all generally know what a 1911 is. But hold on just a second. Every single day is the worst day of my life. Oh, okay. Keeps yeah, yeah. So those tapes are threat echoes. Okay. Just want to check out all these tapes that I've got. I keep dying, so I keep collecting tapes. I wonder how many tapes there are. But anyways, let's check out the uh, 1911. Hmm. So, let's see. Uh, aim weapon. Holster weapon, push. Oh, a tab, yeah. Pull back, slide to chamber around. At least slide lock. Let me just pull this out. Can we uh, remove rounds from the magazine? Alright, just uh... Alright, so let's pull out the gun. The gun is unloaded. Alright. Spec chamber, hold T and R to do a little press check. Toggle the safety. Uh, pull the hammer, which is already pulled. Release hammer, hold, boom, boom. Okay. Insert magazine, push Z. <laughs> How do you, uh,. Uh, eject the magazine. Push E. Alright, so push Z. Stop magazine is E. And, uh... Nothing else? Okay. Alright, so let me, uh... Holster this. Uh, let's put some rounds into the magazine. That's about seven. And then... Take out the gun... Tab. Insert the magazine. And then pull back the slide, which is R. Failure to feed, huh? Z. Ah, okay. Okay, alright, cool. No malfunctions too, huh? Got to do the, uh, what was that, bang tap rack? <laughs> bang. Oh, sorry, uh, yeah. No, no, no. Oh, whatever, hold on, just wait. Okay, that's good. 
And uh, put the safety on. Because you never know when you might accidentally shoot yourself. But uh, remember, when you pull the gun out, V, then you can aim. Always uh, gun safety. Especially in this game, for some reason. <laughs> okay. That's a window. So I need to get five tapes. And, um... on. That was three shots, so seven, six, five, four. So I have four left. <sighs> okay. Hold on just a second. I got to deal with something outside of the game. So let me just pause it. All right. I think it should be back. Hopefully. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Something went all wrong with the air conditioner there. So I had to, I had to fix it, but uh, <laughs> it's okay. It's all good now. Okay. Well, um, doesn't seem like I can get in here, but just want to make sure. I'm not missing anything. Usually there's uh, stuff in here that uh, I can take, but I want to check. Since the doors don't open, I have to break through the windows, and uh, I don't want to waste any ammunition. Alright, well, you know what I need to do? I need to practice my... Um, Whatchamacallit, safety precaution in case I get another one of those uh, threatening tapes, right? When you listen to it, uh, it uh, it tries to make you kill yourself. So I need to practice ejecting the magazine and uh, racking the slide. So it's E and R, right? E is to drop the mag. E, R. Okay, good. Just holster this and uh, add some bullets to the uh, magazine here. Flap it. T and an R. Okay, put the safety on, ready to go. I just love the weapon, uh, the weapon handling in this game. It is, it is very convoluted and complicated, but it is really fun when you finally get like the muscle memory down, right? Ladder, okay. Back to planet. <laughs> hey, what is this? Some secret code stuff here. Might be, uh, it looks like, uh, I'll have to check that out later. Okay, let's just, uh, this off. Got some bullets there. Put the safety back on, just in case. Yeah, you never know. Okay, don't 
don't see anything inside the house. I feel like a burglar <laughs> checking the house. Got some ammo, nice. 45 ACP. About one bullet, that's all you get. Okay, we're gonna go into the house now. Take the safety off. E then R. If if uh, one of those tapes gets you, oh my goodness, that's not good. Come on, turn around. Okay, well, I'm gonna shoot the top of my head then. Can't really hide from that. <laughs> oh, I was demoted? Oh, that's... Okay. But I still get to keep uh, this uh, new unlocked uh, type of weapon, so that's pretty cool. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, release the magazine. No magazine. Check the, uh... Okay, one. Check it. Nice. Safety on. Let's holster it for a bit. What does uh, this mean? That's another magazine. Oops, nope, that's not what I want to do. Uh, R. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, five. I can only put five rounds in this seven round magazine. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty... Oops, not again. Ah, uh, well, I gotta fix this problem. You know what? I'll be right back. Okay, so where was I? Um, sorry about that. Problems again I had to fix. Wait a minute. Is that a flashlight? Yes, it is. Okay. I mean, you know what, since we're, um, since we got demoted, uh, let's, uh, let's have a little fun for a bit, All right, to get back to, uh, to, uh, sleeper rank, so, let's see, IDKFA, IDDQD, okay, uh, I need to check out what the, uh, Let's see, hold on just a second. No, I don't care, please. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay, I know what that one is. That's probably like, um, ghost mode or whatever. You can fly. Uh, what was the one about the, uh, slow motion? Huh. 
Oh, no, not again. Um, hold on just a second. All right, I'm back again. Um, I found out what the, uh, the cheat was for slow motion in the first receiver, but I don't know if it's going to work in this one, so... Ugh. Toggle with X. Okay, it was a uh, tab in the um, previous game. Oh, goodness. Oh, wait. Well, that's right, I have God mode on, right? <laughs> All right, well. Since we have lots of ammo and uh, slow motion and God mode, let's have some fun here. Well, that is really slow. Oh yeah, they run out of ammo too, so... <laughs> Don't need to aim. IDDQD. Alright, you can turn it off. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, you know? That's cool. But I just, you know... You're gonna have a little fun right now, so since I've died so much and I've, like, whatchamacallit, decreased in rank. <laughs> the mind kill degrades the condition of firearms, making them much more likely to malfunction. You can clear most malfunctions by tapping the magazine to make sure it's seated, racking the slide to chamber a new round, and then bang, you're ready to go. Tap, rack, bang. Okay, um, need to take the gun back out. All right. All loaded and ready to go. Let's find some more tapes so we can get back to the uh, sleeper uh, rank. I didn't know you could get demoted. That's, uh, that's a little uh, harsh, though, you know? In, in my opinion, that's just, uh... Oops! I forgot that, uh, you could do that. Accidentally shoot yourself. <laughs> I've God Mode on, so that's okay. Alright. Remove this. Let's holster this again. Let's put the magazine inside. Rack the slide. Let's check. Oh, didn't quite get that. There we go. And put the safety on. There we go. No more neg negligent discharge. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta put the safety on. Because if you don't put the safety on... Oh, did that, uh... There we go. Because if you don't put the safety on... <laughs> oh wait, hold on. Stovepipe? What is this talking about? It's a, a malfunction. Failure to eject. But do I have it right now? IDKFA. <laughs> Get more bullets in there. Put that one in the uh, holster. Uh, all right, tab, unholster. I, I really got to memorize these uh, directions. Z, insert, tap, rack, bang. Let's put it on safe. All right, let's uh, see if I can find these tapes. If not, we're going to have a little fun, but... Uh,
Hey, come on now. Oh, it's uh safe. I forgot. Ouch. That hurts. You gonna reload? Well, you know, there is a uh Oh, my, my hand is shaking. Hold on. There we go. If you shoot the motor, it'll stop following you, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, that's the motor. This is the camera right here. And then, uh... It's a battery pack. Oh no, that might be the ammo. I think. Was it the ammo, this one? No. Okay. Make sure it's uh, chambered properly. We live in a world in which hostile thoughts and ideas are constantly present in the media, pressing in on our consciousness. Events are often also outside of our control, outside of our control, but not outside of control. Others use these concepts and events to create this anxiety. Thoughts flow in a sequence, and by inserting harmful media into your life, your thoughts can be hijacked. Once you are behaving in a reactive state, you will spread these contaminated ideas to others, allowing them to degrade more people. Practice basic media safety. Control your information environment. Act, don't react. If you run out of ammo, you can no longer defend yourself against kill drones. However, they are predictable, and with enough focus, you can get past them without using your firearm at all. Got to practice my uh, reloading, you know? Past events that have caused recurring negative thoughts and emotions are called mental trauma. This was often the result of a sudden shift in perception. Building blocks of our self our place in it. When these ideas turn out to be false, it causes a chain reaction that can threaten every aspect of our life. Oops, stovepipe jam. While removing one brick from a tower can cause it to collapse, 
that does not mean that the problem was widespread. It was a failure in a single element. It's how critical each belief is, and how finding and removing false beliefs early can prevent a catastrophic chain reaction. When John Moses Browning finished the Colt 1911 pistol, the streets of Ogden, Utah were still lit by gas lamps and echoed with the clatter of horse-drawn carriages. Now, while Zeppelins, propeller planes, and bell-bottom pants came and went, his 1911 pistol is still holding its own in militaries and law enforcement around the world. As the son of a polygamist Mormon gunsmith, Browning had 21 siblings, which may explain his fascination with automatic weapons. <laughs> anyway, uh, throughout his career, he designed many of America's small arms in World War I and II, uh, including the Browning automatic rifle, 1917 light machine gun, uh, M2 heavy machine gun, and the Auto 5 shotgun. He eventually died at his workbench while working on the Browning high power pistol, which was so high powered that it took his breath away. All right. Get rank up the sleeper, which, uh, be tough. <laughs> but, uh, I think that might be it for today. I've kind of, uh, wasted your, everybody's time. Oh, hey. Got the Glock 17. Let me just check this out. <clears throat> but this is yeah so it's the Glock 17 got some good lighting here so don't need to uh, see much of it let me just uh, eject the mag do I have a magazine let's check the chamber nothing it is empty got magazine here 16 rounds, 9mm, chamber the round. DQD. Okay. Let's turn that off. I'm not going to play, I'm just going to show off the uh, Glock 17. But uh, let's see. I'll go full automatic, so push V. Ah. Get some bullets in this thing. Let's see what we can do. Oh, no, this is semi-automatic. Uh-oh. That's uh, empty. Oops, empty. Holster. Put some um, ammunition into the magazine. Okay. Put it in. Uh, disengage the slide lock. And uh, let's toggle. Let's just check. And then toggle full auto. This is full auto, I think. Uh oh. Something went wrong. Tap. Oh. Empty. Uh, insert magazine. Let's put back the semi-auto and uh 
That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, uh, I think that's about it for today. It's getting uh, this video is getting a little too long because I kind of uh, messed up uh, and died after I got the sleeper rank. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to stop it for right now. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.